In this quick video, we're going to take a look at how to embed Google files onto a page in Canvas. So I'm here on a new page, and I can do this in a page or an assignment anywhere I see the rich content editor box here. I, I've got it open. What I like to do is I like to get my cursor where I want it to go. So right now it's kind of left align. I can switch to center align if I wanted to. That's just a, a setting I like to take care of. It's not imperative that you do that. Once you're there, look right here, you'll see the Google Drive symbol right up towards the top in the toolbar. When I click on that, it's going to open up my Google Drive. If I know where things are saved in my folder, I can just find the folder and open it up and do it that way. Or if I'd like to type it in, because I know the title of it, I can do that as well. And of course it comes up in here and I kind of just scroll down until I find the one that I want. And here is my main idea one. When I click on that, I get two options at the bottom. Now, keep in mind, depending on what screen you're using, you might have to scroll down, especially on a Chromebook. Your screen may not be as big, so you may have to scroll down to see this option. But you have two options, embed and link. Link is going to just put just that, a link on the page where students will click on that. It will open a new tab with whatever the resource is. Or you have the embed. And when I click embed, it's going to put the document or the file right there on in Canvas. So the students do not have to go to a different tab to see it. Either way is fine. It's totally by your preference. Then I hit save and publish. And I have my, my document right there. Keep in mind that what you'll probably want to do first is go to the document itself and change the share settings in in Google. So let's take a quick look at that. So here's that document that I've embedded. I just want to make sure that I go up here to the share button and click on that and make sure that I have it set. Oops, zoomed way too far in for you. So click on share. Make sure that right here, if it's a new document, it'll probably say restricted. Just go ahead and change that probably to anyone at Concord can view. And that's all you have to do. Just make sure that is set. That way, when your students go into Canvas, they don't get that please request access look here. But that's all you really have to do to embed a Google content onto um, a Canvas page.